Hello folks. Well, a lot of you already know this, but you know others may not, especially the new users. So, and I've recently been asked about it as well, so hence this video. First of all, there's a screen recording available on the DJI RC2 controller. It records exactly what is shown on the screen, but it doesn't record to the required high-speed card the RC2 holds in its slot. So in order to get those screen videos onto the card and off, it's a bit tricky, but once you know the key, it's easy. So here we go. Okay, once you're on, in fact, I'm gonna go ahead, you wanna swipe down twice. This gets you into this screen. This screen, all you have to do is hit right there, record, and this begins recording internally. It doesn't record onto the card at all that plugs in here. It only is recording this internally right now. Okay, in order to get this off after you're done recording, you have to hit this again, swipe down twice, and go to this little cog-shaped icon right here and click that. Once you click that, you've gotta go here to storage, and you click storage. And this shows photos and videos and how much is used. Now, there's no three-line menu here. So in order to get that, you have to click on music and audio, I found. And there's no files in here, just the way it is. Then you'll get the three-line menu. And I'm going to click this. And click videos. And this shows the videos. So I can click movies and take a video like this one and highlight it and then go up here to this and click either copy to or move to and I'm going to say move to so then I, I click this when you click the three menu lines it brings you to this then click on downloads and you will see the card mine is order head Click on that, and then you can see the different documents that are already in there. And then move. And that says moving one item, and that's done. And as you see, it's gone. And this is the one that's recording right now. Well, that's it. Pop your SD card out of your transmitter, pop it into your computer, and you download it, and away you go. Okay, the next thing we're going to look at is how I recorded the screen on the iPhone when I was flying the Neo. Okay, real easy to get in to it. All you do is swipe from this corner like this. And this gets you into your mode where you can adjust your brightness, the volume of your screen and stuff. But down here is a little dot, red dot. And when you click that, that starts recording. And now everything that I do on the screen is recording. So if I want to open an, an app, you know, to check it, it's recording. Everything that I would do uh, on here uh, records. Um, I can open up also my DJI app like this. Even my own website I can open. And all of this is being recorded right now. As you can see up here in the top left, that red dot means it's recording everything on the screen. So, let's say I wanted to watch a YouTube video, a short, for example. Everything is being recorded. Here's what they do. Designed to facilitate. And here is an example of the webcam at Lake Okoboji, Iowa. And uh, I am recording that too, just by uh, watching the uh, webcam. So it's a neat feature if you've got an iPhone, or I don't know if the Androids do that, but I'm sure they do. And I'm going to stop the recording. I can click that right there. And it will ask me, do I stop? I say, yes, stop. I go to my videos. 
There is the recording. Again, just swipe down, click record. At this point, I then use the SanDisk thumb drive for iPhones to download my videos. Thanks so much for watching Mr. Herbert's Science Class. This is Dave Herbert signing off till the next episode.